I think that a lot of what Mick says, you know, that... that he said, Jamie said he's going to come rip the belt from me. Of course. Michael says he's going to punch my head in. Yes. Yes, I said he's going to come win on points. For me, coming to win on points and ripping my belt off me are two different things. Either way. Either so way, just make sure you, you come to the punch belt, my head in. the belt, whether it's points or whether I stop you. Let's be honest. You could stop by a guy at McDonald's. Jazz and Dickens had you in your feet. They're both not. You just keep punches. watching them too far. You, don't have you a keep studying them too far. You keep studying. You can discredit me all you want. You're just trying to convince I'm yourself. Not I, don't, I haven't, I haven't, I told I haven't you I mentioned none of your fader. performances. I was so happy with your performance. Sorry, I didn't realize you were trying to talk. I thought you were a great fader. I do think you're a great fader. I think you punch hard. You're a good fader. You have good boxing ability. But like I said yesterday, no good punch, slow feet, curly head. I'll punch your head in. That, that talk about you folding under pressure, I was, obviously that is the unknown, how you will handle that. Is that is something you've dreamed of for a long time? Ben talks about how mentally strong you are as well. There is also the argument that, that you will thrive under my, that. My, my greatest assets don't even get talked about one bit. Um, dedication, my life, and I put my life on hold. Boxing is everything for me, and it always has been since a young age. Um, He's going to look at these defeats, and that's just going to work in my favour. Everyone looks at that. Everyone I actually maybe don't look at, the look at your defeats. Maybe look at the power. I don't look at your defeats. He's just trying to... Um, I don't look at your defeats. Just mention them. I mentioned yeah. them, but I don't look at them. I, I don't need to discredit the Michael. Michael. I don't need to look at his performances. Ben, well. you had to come. You this, weren't even this. meant to come, Ben. You took a day off Sorry, being the best, I'll hardest working coach minute. in the world to come here. You know what I mean? You were the hardest coach in the world. Meant of going through and Josh Taylor yesterday. And actually, he says, I, went, I can't come here. Actually, I went home and worked. Actually, I went home and worked. Actually, I went home and worked. As I was saying, I don't need to nitpick for his performances. I know what I'm going to do. I know exactly what I need to do. He can analyse all them performances. Gavin McDonald can't punch the skin off rice pudding and he punched him made in and stopped me. But if they want to watch that fight, then they're in for a very hard night. Yeah, I haven't even watched Jazzy Dickens, I was training to exercise for less. Basically training myself. I had a lot of problems in my life. I had a seven-month-old child that I'd not seen. I had relationship issues, loads of things. I had bronchitis three weeks before the fight. But if you want to watch them, discredit them fights, go ahead and watch them. Again, I even the David them. Oliver Joyce fight, um, Mate, I wasn't even 60% fitness. Was I wasn't done. even 60% fitness. he was done. Fit, and he was ringside. I could have shoved the tennis done. ball in your mouth when I put him down. Was washed. But, um, Davey was washed at that stage <clears throat> of his career. You met a young David Oliver anyway, Joyce who would have took you to school. Michael's a great fighter. He's had some really good wins. He's a really big challenge. But um, I know I need to do on fight night. And um, it's going to make me discredit him. It's going to make my win look even worse. I just want to say how good a fighter he is. How a great champion he is. He's a great uh, public for the public eye in Ireland is massive uh, profile and um, all the best on fight night because you're going to need it.